good morning students today we discuss about the petromyzone its habit habitat and saline features first of all its classification let us see the classification or systematic position the phylum chordata it belongs to the group craniata because uh, the cranium is present uh, brain box is present around the brain and the subphylum is vertebrata because notochord is uh, modified into the vertebral column division agnatha Ag agnatha means uh, the jaws are absent class cyclostomata the mouth is rounded cyclo means rounded stomata mean um, mouth order petromyzontiformis petromyzon ke jaise animals genus petromyzon species marinus or common name is uh, lamprey first of all its habit and habitat lamprey are predators and live on uh, fishes turtle and many other aquatic animals although they have the power of swift swimming they usually remain attached to the other fishes or stone by the, the help of sectorial mouth while they attached to the fish they the rest the flesh by the horny teeth on the buccal funnel and tongue apparatus lamprey usually live in the sea and migrate to the river for the purpose of spawning and that is uh, they migrate in the, into the from the sea to river that is anadromous migration after spawning they usually die in the river system the lamprey do not eat anything but live on the uh, accumulated subcutaneous subcutaneous fat that provide the nourishment during the period they they migrate to the river usually in autumn while the sexual maturity is attained but breeding occur in spring a freshwater lamprey metromyzon petromyzon marinus unicolor migrate a few mile upstream for the purpose of spawning this is the uh, petromyzon and this is the hagfish these two animals are cyclostomes and this is the uh, uh, cylindrical structure or uh, snake like or eel like structure and sectorial mouth having two uh, rounded eyes and a metallic uh, color this is the attached to the uh, fishes and this is the sectorial mouth or rounded mouth these are the scars on the uh, body of fish where they attaches and when they attach to the when they, uh, they can attach they can suck to the uh, human blood also and they are this is the very dangerous things and these are the first and single nasal apparatus is found sectorial uh, at the dorsal mid dorsal line and these are the rows of teeth external structure lamprey has an ill like cylindrical body upper side of the body is usually dark and the lower surface is white the surface of the body is smooth and slimy because there is no scale or scales are absent there is no exoskeleton on their body the body is divided into head trunk and tail head and trunk are cylindrical and tail is uh, laterally compressed paired fins are absent you know, pectoral and pelvic both fins are absent and median fin and uh, two dorsal fin first dorsal and second dorsal and one caudal fin are the their locomotory organs and is anus is lying is slightly in the depression in the ventral side immediately behind the anus a small papilla is present this papilla is pierced by the urinogenital aperture or at its extremity the fins are supported by the cartilaginous rays and these rays are fused to Uh, their vessel ends and the membranous covering that surrounds the notochord and nerve cord the head region is characterized by the development of a special cup like structure called buccal funnel this funnel is actually the downwardly directed depression the aim of the buccal funnel are be beside the papilla numerous small horny teeth are present inside the cavity mouth cavity the mouth is a circular opening um, situated at the bottom of the buccal funnel just behind the nasal opening there is a yellow spot indicating the position of internal pineal eye the paired eyes are well developed and seven pairs of round gill opening are present on the posterior lateral side of head and anterior part of trunk locomotion lamprey swim by the activity of myo uh, myotomal longitudinal muscle fibers swimming is affected by the prolonged waves and uh, curvature down the body alternatively on the east side the lamprey the waves are very short in comparison to the body length and a consequence progression is um, so rapid expulsion of water through the gills opening like uh, also help in the progression like jet a skeletal structure notochord is present and uh, composed of the large vacuolated notochordal cells and uh, remain 
enveloped by thick fibrous notochordal sheath. Skull is endoskeleton is cartilaginous. Skull is in form of incomplete cartilaginous box or chondrocranium. Chondrocranium surrounds the brain enclosing the brain and has special sense organs. The olfactory capsule is imperfectly period plate which support the posterior wall of olfactory sac. This capsule is united with the cranium by fibrous tissue. On each side of the vessel plate there lies a subocular arch to support eyes. Digestive system the following parts digestive system have the following parts mouth, buccal funnel, velar apparatus, uh, uh, respiratory tract with, with tentacles, intestine, true stomach is absent, in lamprey a, a long intestine is present, intestine open to, into the rectum and rectum op open by anus to outside. The actual mode of feeding in lamprey is not known while they attached with the body of fish they eat the flesh and by the rasping with the tongue apparatus. The intestine of a fleshy detached lamprey is found to be filled by the blood which also indicate their sanguivorous habit. Respiratory system. The respiration uh, respiratory system consists of seven pair of gills, open gills. There is no operculum and the gills are pouched like structure and they are therefore they are called as marsipobranchs. Each gill pouch appears in the biconvex lines and the inner wall is folded by the numerous gill lamellae and the outer wall is highly muscular. Therefore, the lamprey is called as marsipobranchs. The gaseous exchange occur inside the gill pouches. Circulatory system. Close type circulatory system is well developed in the lamprey. The heart is as shaped and two chambered, one auricle and one ventricle. And an extra uh, heart chamber is also uh, sinus venous is, is present. The impure blood collected by the arteries and they, uh, by the veins and uh, drop into the uh, uh, sinus venous and from sinus venous to auricle, auricle to ventricle, ventricle to uh, gills by dorsal. Uh, venous. Heart is enclosed by pericardium. The blood of lamprey is red in color. RBC and WBC both are present and the hemoglobin remain inside the RBCs. The white blood cells are similar to the lymphocytes or polymorph in higher like higher vertebrates. Nervous system of lamprey is well developed. 10 pair of cranial nerves are present. Brain is the, the neural tube becomes modified anteriorly into the brain and the brain and the spinal cord. Brain and spinal cord are the central nervous system of plant brain. Brain is divided into three parts, forebrain, midbrain and uh, hindbrain and there are 10 pair of cranial nerves uh, ejecting out from the midbrain uh, and forebrain and they uh, spread into the body. And the meru, the spinal nerves are from the exit, uh, exit out from the spinal cord and they spread into the whole body. Excretory system, mesonephric type kidney is present and uh, by the excretion the, they have the Bowman's capsule and the glomerulus for the filtering of blood and the uh, waste product are collected into the by the ureter into the uh, um, uh, and uh, expelled out from the body by the urinogenital aperture. Each kidney maintains its uh, dorsal wall silum by the peri peritoneal sheet the ureter over posteriorly into the urinogenital sinus or aperture. Reproductive system. Sex, sexes are separate or in other word we can say the lamprey is unisexual. Uh, male and female are different. different. The gonad is large unpaired, is occupying a median position of the mesonephros kidney. Primordial germ cells migrate to such gonadal ridges, um, sperm and ova. Differentiation of gonad takes place quietly rare as a the consequence of amocyte larva possesses the hermaphroditic gonads containing both oocytes and spermatocytes. Gonad extend almost to the whole body of the cavity and leg the reproductive duct. Sexual cells or gametes or sperms or ovum are discharged into the body cavity and leave the body from the abdominal pore. These pores are present in the wall of uh, urinogenital sinus and for the spawning. So, this is all about the lamprey and its habit, habitat and saline features. Thank you, thank you very much. And this uh, in the, our next lecture, we discuss about the amocyte larva in the uh, lamprey or the larva of lamprey, the amocyte larva. Anadromous migration is found in the lamprey and anadromous migration is the last migration of its life.